a nice creative way is <laughs> perfect. Well, I'm kind of old fashioned. I like to just go up to, hey, you and me, we're going to go on a date. This is where we're going to go. So it's the easiest way to do it. I guess you just come out and say it. Like, hey, do you want to go on a date? These are uncomfortable questions. I don't, I don't really ask. I just be like, you're my girl now. It's kind of a, it's not an option. Really. You have to make it special. You know, something well, I'd probably show up to their house with a dozen roses and ask their father permission. Well, personally, I asked my girlfriend out on FaceTime. Probably shouldn't do that. Romantic date on the ocean. Probably somewhere nice. No, actually somewhere fun. Cause you want to know who they really are. So go like go kart, like laser tagging, something like midnight. Mmm. A drive through to the D. A nice long walk on the beach. <laughs> and afterwards, some. Chocolate covered strawberries. <laughs> My perfect day would probably be at some steakhouse. I like eating out and it's got a steak. I like that protein. FIFA on the couch. Go fishing. God, it's raunchy. There's kind of a borderline. Uh, you don't want to go too far to where it's kind of naughty, naughty, because that's not good. It's disgusting. No one wants to see that. I think it's okay, like if you're holding hands or whatever, when you start necking in the hallway, like that's where the line is drawn. I don't, I don't want to see anyone making out in public, but like hand holds, they're fine. It's just nasty. It's gross. Unless, unless people are married, it's just weird. It depends if. If I, if the two people are like good looking, if if the girl's good looking, then go for it. Um, don't be gross about it. I mean, if you just want to like kiss, that's fine. It's so gross. If you're gonna do it, like that's fine. Make it secretive. You don't have to do it in public where everyone can see it. It's just gross. Um, never really. But if there were a nickname to be thrown at me, I'd prefer Big Daddy. Oh, way before you're dating. Anytime. Never. They're gross. Right off the bat. Big Daddy. No, like short names for your actual name, I think is fine. Oh, he's here. Um, you know, I get called Teddy Bear a lot. Babe. Sexy. Darling. <laughs> Baby. Daddy in general. <laughs> Well, for example, my girlfriend's name is Gabrielle, and we've been calling her Flabby Gabby. <laughs> Lovely. Um, Boo, maybe? I think Boo is a good name to call people, I think. Poppy. About babe, that's about it. Gabber. Big Daddy Z. Um, I like getting called Mare <laughs> or Mer. Scabby Gabby. Well, I always give good presents, personally. Uh, the finest chocolate you could find around here in Kansas City. Always. Um, nothing too out there. Like, I've seen um, couples giving each other, like, hundreds of dollars worth of gifts. But um, I'm fine with, like, like, a little accessory. Roses and chocolates. And the occasional stuff. I mean, unless you have like a special meaning behind one, just a teddy bear. It's not so much about presents and stuff, but definitely like getting to spend time face to face with is much more important than any of that. Extravagant ones, like boxes of chocolate, teddy bears. I think flowers are really sweet, and I think candy's really cute. Roses. Non existing. Yeah. Roses. Oh, roses. If you're going to get her some flowers, you don't want to get like a crap load of red roses because that's like. 
let's get married. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's a way attached and I freak her out, I feel like. So I think maybe one, one rose would be a good idea. Oh, it says, hey, I like you. <laughs> Roses. Smoking hot. Um, I like, I like them to be sweet and I have high standards. Uh, she has to be pretty nice, smart, drop that gorgeous. Um, somebody that uh, likes me, obviously, because I don't want her to not like me, because that would be bad. Uh, somebody that uh, is comfortable around me, isn't scared to talk to me. He has to be nice, he has to be um, thoughtful, he has to be caring, he has to be appreciative of everything we do for them. We do a lot. I don't look for girlfriends because girlfriends are stupid. Um, a good personality, someone that makes me laugh. Someone that I find attractive. Um, someone that's honest. Um, I like a, a tall girl with blonde hair and blue eyes. And I, I'd like her to be funny and intelligent. Um, 